I'm here with Eric Munoz in Lion Bull Academy. Today I'm really sorry, I already was posted in YouTube. Uh, Monday I was not able to post the video because of work. Tuesday I am almost finished the videos and today finally I think will be everything uploaded. So thank you, um, thank you one more time for the wait and sorry one more time for that. Let's uh, today talking about one new strategy. It's a strategy that really I invented. It's, uh, you cannot find, I think, nowhere this strategy. It's a strategy that anybody can use it really, have his good times, his bad time, like always. But let's now explain. It's uh, really, if you don't have too much time for looking the market, this is a great strategy for start with. Okay, mm, let's start explaining about the strategy. The explanation of the strategy is quite simple. Uh, we mm, waiting each Monday, like every Monday, we waiting that the Monday finish, like we say, mm, I don't know, start the week and finish the Monday. We uh, draw in one uh, rectangle where we show the maximum and the minimum of the day. Like we can look in, in the candle if you want in one day candle and find the maximum and the minimum. And after the Tuesday, we waiting for the breakout of this rectangle. Uh, here I have one example show that the was in loose, but I want to that you see exactly how it's working. The um, Monday we work we draw in maximum and minimums like you can see here in this rectangle. Then we wait that the price broke the rectangle in one direction like this. If broke above, we go in buy. If it broke below, we go in sell. And when broke, the candle must mm, the candle must uh, close above that point if no we don't enter we wait in the close of the candle for the confirmation then in the next candle we enter in the market the stop loss will be the um, atr number in this case example is 11 the double of the atr plus 10 pips in this case example the atr in this candle show us 11 was show us okay 11 so will be 11 per 2 is 22 plus 10 so 32 pips we will make a stop loss in 32 pips and the take profit like oh, i always like it i make the double of the stop loss in this case will be mm, exactly the double okay uh, we make um, take profit and stop loss in this situation exactly the price go against us operation and we lose like we can say 50 dollars Always as risk um, have to be always fixing fifty dollars and as profit fixing hundred dollars. Let's look in one example more. Here is one operation also one um, the Monday we open um, as nice quadrat as rectangle and Tuesday was coming one enter but why we don't take this enter I here you, you can see I don't show no one enter. Is because when we was make the stop loss, the um, stop loss was bigger than 50 pips. I recommend depends always in instrument. Example in Euro USD, any stop loss bigger than 50 pips, included the 50, it's probably gonna be in loose. So I prefer to avoid that one. Then every time the stop loss is greater than 50 pips, I ignore the operation. Let's go here one more time. Again, we are in Monday. We draw in as rectangle the minimum and the maximum. Tuesday, the price broke above the rectangle and close above it. We um, check as enter. Will be in this candle here. Um, the atr will be ten. Then we need to make the stop loss the double of the atr plus ten pips. It means thirty. We put a stop loss in 30 pips, then as take profit will be 60 pips. And this one was perfect. After the market go down, we don't care. Then next days, we already ignore it. We're waiting for the next Monday. Then uh, I have here one example that I also normally take. Let's say the Monday we draw in as rectangle, the maximum and the minimum. But Tuesday, the price stay inside the rectangle. Then what we do it with the end of Tuesday, draw in one more rectangle. Like this, we can enter in Thursday. Um, I maximum recommend to use Monday and Tuesday. 
After that, we ignore the week. If in Monday and Tuesday don't come in the operation and in the next day in Thursday maximum, we ignore the operations. Here we have one more in, um, how I say you, in Thursday. The price broke above the Tuesday rectangle, close above. Then we have a ATR of 12. We make the stop loss the double of the ATR plus 10, it means 34, and as take profit will be 68. And he get for the beginning of the next week or in the end of the night. Okay, let's uh, find one more operation. Here we have one more. Monday, the price, um, we pr prepare the rectangle. Tuesday, the price really broke above, but because it was almost in the end of the day, I prefer to wait until Thursday. But as that's the pen of you. We'll work in also the same if you want to take also so late. But for me, I think it's more comfortable to take it this um, trade in the next day. So I draw in one more time Tuesday the rectangle and I enter in Thursday. Um, other stuff to say: if you you can uh, if you want it, you can use the risk reward one two. That is what I use it. Is risk one dollar for make two dollars. Or the one one point five, it means you risk one dollar for make one dollar and a half. The ratio of um, good operation increase. That's hard to say. But when you have a loses, uh, you're gonna need more percentage of win ratio for um, get um, in profit by the end of the month. So I recommend you. For my point of view, I prefer one two. You have less operation good ones, but they are give you more profit. So that's all the pain of you you need to start working in your uh, tolerance to risk to understand how you want to trade this um, kind of strategies we can see here one more one more rectangle the monday we enter in the market perfect then we have here one more that we don't enter because you can see no one of the rectangle was broken close above or below in the Thursday, so we ignore it. We have one more here. We draw in the Monday, we get us profit. We have here one lose, we get us uh, target enter and as entry point. And what happened here? Go and lose it. It's okay, it's normal. We have one second lose here. Not always gonna be a win. Let's uh, now here is also a lose, you can see clearly. It's okay. You need to understand that not every time gonna be a win. Here we mm, don't enter in the market. No Monday, no Tuesday. It's not a market to enter. You can see no one enter. Then we have one more here. Perfect. Monday close, and then the next day um, broke above the rectangle. So good. We can look in here how it is. Let's say the maximum and the minimum. Nothing. Maximum and minimum. Here we have one enter to a sell but go wrong. Also a lose. Here we have a entry point. Perfect. In the Tuesday after the Tuesday broke. Here mm, nothing. Nothing. And we have an enter in Thursday. And this one was also in profit, so that will be good. Also good. Um, here we have one, one more. You can see broke above the Monday high. One enter. But you can see the strategy is working really good. It's not difficult. I think anybody can do it quietly. Here we have one enter exactly in this candle. Here we go check. And here we can enter. I'm not so sure if we get the profit, but let, let's try. Mm, long position. We enter in this candle. Will be 17, 34, 44 pips. Forty-four pips. The target is the double, and you can see here, it's not good. 
this was also loose so not nothing we go to the next one and like this time by time till we get a possible end other stuff you i recommend you if you want it you can always put the um, stop loss in um, break even when you already are more than the half of the trade in the right direction you can also do that one there's many ways to do it i normally like to let go if it's touch one or the other why because like this i are more quiet in my trade i'm not worried and i know that by the end of the month i will be in profit the most of the time sometimes also can go wrong the month but not always so that was everything if you have some question about the strategy just comment me down below if you like this kind of content the only stuff i ask you just to please click the like button and subscribe to the channel is the only thing i ask him to you if you have own um, strategies you want to share with somebody and, and or you want to explain it to me i will be very happy to learn it tested it for uh, in simulator like i show you in the past video you have a simulator that you can download for free the demo and if you after join my trading my trading floor i will be able to give it to you also and you can start practicing all these strategies in the simulator first for increase your time of learning you can learn it more faster everything so i really recommend you to use the simulator try them if you have strategies you can send to me i will try them study them a complete months and after say you my mm, my things about this strategy if it's working good or no if it's i think was a right idea or no uh, let's find out together all this stuff if you have something but you never tested before but you're thinking it's a great strategy i will be very happy even to make a video about it and show to everybody if you wa want it of course so that was everything and see you next time ciao